Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about a fault code that can be a bit of a head-scratcher, P2016, intake manifold channel. Position sensor slash low switching circuit, row 1. This code can cause a variety of symptoms, including a rough idle, hesitation on acceleration, and even a check engine light. In this video, we're going to break down what this code means, what causes it, and how to fix it. We'll also talk about some of the tools and resources you'll need to diagnose and repair this problem. So, if you're experiencing this code, or you're just curious about what it means, be sure to check out this video. The P2016 code indicates a problem with the intake manifold runner position sensor circuit, specifically in row 1. This sensor is responsible for monitoring the position of the intake manifold runners, which control the amount of air that enters the engine. When the PCM, powertrain control module, detects a problem with the sensor or its circuit, it sets the P2016 code. Several potential causes can trigger the P2016 code. 1. Faulty intake manifold runner position sensor. The sensor itself could be malfunctioning, sending incorrect signals to the PCM. 2. Damaged wiring or connectors. Damaged or corroded wiring or loose connectors in the sensor circuit can disrupt the signal transmission. 3. Vacuum leak. A vacuum leak in the intake manifold can affect the sensor's readings and trigger the code. 4. Carbon buildup. Excessive carbon buildup in the intake manifold can interfere with the sensor's operation. 5. PCM malfunction. In rare cases, a faulty PCM could be the culprit behind the P2016 code. The P2016 code can cause various symptoms, including check engine light illumination, this is the most common symptom, indicating a problem with the engine control system. Rough idle. The engine may idle rough due to the incorrect air-fuel mixture caused by the faulty sensor. Reduced engine power. The engine may experience reduced power due to the inability to control the air intake properly. Increased fuel consumption. The engine may consume more fuel due to the inefficient combustion caused by the incorrect air-fuel mixture. If you encounter the P2016 code, it's crucial to diagnose and address the underlying cause promptly to prevent further damage to your vehicle's engine and ensure optimal performance. The P2016 code is associated with the intake manifold runner control system, which is responsible for adjusting the length of the intake runners to optimize engine performance at different RPMs. When this system malfunctions, it can lead to a variety of symptoms, including check engine light illumination. This is the most common symptom of the P2016 code. The check engine light will illuminate on the dashboard, indicating that a problem has been detected with the engine control system. Rough idle. The engine may idle rough or stall due to the incorrect air slash fuel mixture caused by the malfunctioning intake manifold runner control system. Hesitation or lack of power. The engine may hesitate or lack power when accelerating, especially at low RPMs. This is because the intake manifold runners are not positioned correctly to provide the optimal air slash fuel mixture for the engines. Current operating conditions. Increased fuel consumption. The engine may consume more fuel than usual due to the inefficient combustion caused by the malfunctioning. Intake manifold runner control system. Black smoke from the exhaust. Black smoke from the exhaust is a sign of incomplete combustion, which can be caused by the incorrect air slash fuel mixture. Diagnosing the P2016 code requires a thorough inspection of the intake manifold runner control system. This includes checking the following components. Intake manifold runner control valve. This valve is responsible for adjusting the length of the intake runners. It should be inspected for any signs of damage or wear. Intake manifold runner position sensor. This sensor monitors the position of the intake runners and sends this information to the engine control unit, ECU. It should be checked for proper operation and any signs of damage. Wiring and connectors. The wiring and connectors associated with the intake manifold runner control system should be inspected for any signs of damage or corrosion. In addition to inspecting these components, a diagnostic scan tool can be used to retrieve additional information about the P2016 code. This information can help to pinpoint the specific cause of the problem. The repair for the P2016 code will depend on the specific cause of the problem. In some cases, the problem may be as simple as a loose or damaged connector. However, in other cases, 
The problem may require replacing the intake manifold runner control valve or the intake manifold runner position sensor. If you are not comfortable repairing the problem yourself, it is recommended that you take your vehicle to a qualified mechanic for diagnosis and repair.